Hello all, welcome to my channel. Today I will demonstrate you how to use the button and text view in the Android Kotlin. I will develop the simple Android application to increment the counter of the different four buttons into the text view. So let's do the same thing practically. First of all, you can just click on create new project. Here you can select the empty activity and you can click on next. Here you can give the name of your application. I'm just giving the name of my application is button and text view demo. Here you can choose the language and that is Kotlin. Here you can click on finish. Once your Gradle build is done, you can just minimize this project exploration. Here you can just click on activity main.xml that is the design part. And here you can click on that is a so system user interface and then you can click on split. So what happened? It will open the XML file as well as the design here. You can simply select this text view and you can simply remove this. Now I want to take a four different button and one text view. So let me simply drag and drop this text view. So I'm just to simply drag and drop over here. And here you can just give the width and height. So I'm just giving the width of this text view is 200 dp and the height is that is 300 dp. Here you can just change the text. For example, the text is you have not clicked any button yet. So this is my default text of text view. I want this text in a center. So you can use the property and that property is the gravity property and you can align it a center. So your text will be in a center. I want to increase the size of this text. So you can use the property that is a text size and you can make it here. For example, 20 SP. So the font will be increased. Then you can use the text style. For example, bold. So your style will be bold and here. You can use the one more property and that is the text color. I want the color is red. So I'm just taking here that is has F00. So my text color will be red. Now I want the four different button and that four button is north, east, west and south. So you can simply drag and drop this text view and then you can just drag and drop the button over here. So I want this button in a north side. I want one more button that is over here in a west side. I want one more button over here and that is in a east side. I want another button and that is over here and that is you can say south side. Then once all this is done, you can select your text view and you can click over here. That is infer constraint. Whenever you click on infer constraint, this five errors will be removed. So you can just click on infer constraint. Whenever you click on infer constraint, see this five errors will be removed. See here, right? Now, whenever user click on any button, I want the counter over here. This button is clicked how many times? So I just want to change the text of this button. So here this is the button that is the ID and here you can change the text. This button is the north button. Button number two and that button is west button. Button number three and button number three is over here. So you can say that this button is a east button and button number four. This is the button number four. So I want that this is a south button. Now whenever user click on any button, I want the counter. But before that, I want to run this application. So you can simply run this application. Whenever you run this application, your application will be launched into emulator. So here in this emulator, you will get the output. See here. So I'm getting here. There are four buttons: north, east, west and south. Whenever you click on north, I want the counter over here that the north is clicked and how many times that I want. So here you can just do what this north button ID is the button number one. So here north button has the ID button. 
So I want the counter of each and every button. So you can just move to your main activity dot Kotlin file. This is your coding file. Here you can just initialize your counter variable. So I'm just taking the four counter variable one variable and that is north counter is equal to zero variable west counter is equal to zero variable east counter is equal to zero variable south counter is equal to zero now whenever user click on button i want to increment the north counter if it is a north button so i'm taking here that is variable b1 is equal to find view by id and you can cast it into button so your button id is r dot id dot button whenever this button is clicked so you can use the function that is set on click listener use the lambda expression over here so whenever the button one dot set on click listener it means that the button one is clicked that is the north button so i just want to increment the north counter that is north counter plus plus and i want to set the text that the north is clicked how many times so here you can take text view object so you can write variable tv is equal to find view by id now we will cast it into text view so we can write here r dot id dot text view and here you can write text view dot set text north is clicked dollar and cnt that is your variable name right so north counter times so north is clicked how many times that i will get using the button you can simply run this particular application so whenever you run this application your application will be launched into emulator and whenever you click on north you will get the counter over here see north is clicked one times north is clicked two times three times four times five times six times right but i want the counter of each and every variable right so here what we can do very simple you can just simply copy this particular code that is variable b1 is equal to instead of this b1 you can write b2 that is the button number two and the button number two is the west button so here you can write that west counter plus plus and here you can say that west button is clicked wcnt times here you can simply remove this is right now you can simply copy paste your code again so let me copy this you can paste over here now this is the button number three and the button number three is the east button so here you can write variable b3 this is b3 dot set on click listener this is east counter plus plus and here you can say that this east button is clicked east counter times you can paste again and now fourth button and the fourth button is that is b4 here you can write button number four whenever button four is clicked i want to increment the south counter plus plus and here you can write that the south counter times and instead of this west you can write that south is clicked dollar scnt times you can simply run your application and you will get the output over here in your emulator see here i have not clicked on any button so i'm getting the message you have not clicked any button yet but whenever you click on north you will get the counter over here see north button is clicked four times west is clicked two times east is clicked three times south is clicked two times now whenever you click on north it will give me north is clicked five times west is three times north six times south three times east four times but i want all the message together it means that i want the counter of each and every button at the same time so whenever you want the counter of each and every button same time what we can do we can create the function so we don't need to write the repeat code so here you can call the function that is print count so definitely this kind of function is not available in build so i need to create this function so you can press alter enter and it will give you a suggestion create the function print count so you can create the function that is print count 
Now here in a print count function, what we can do? Simple. We can simply cut this text view code and we can paste over here. So our text view will be initialized. Now we can cut this particular code that is text view dot set text. So you can paste over here that is text view dot set text north is clicked and CMT times. Now you can write here slash L and here you can simply cut this particular code that is west is clicked how many times. So you can paste over here west is clicked WCNT times. Now you can cut this particular code that is east is clicked how many times. So you can paste over here after slash sign. So east is clicked ECNT times. Now you can cut this particular that is a south is clicked SCNT times. So you can paste over here after writing slash sign south is clicked SCNT times. And you can call this function print count every time whenever the any button is clicked. So if north button is clicked, then also this print count function will be called. If south button is clicked, then also this print count function will be called. Now you can run this. Whenever you run this, your emulator will launch the new application. Now you have not clicked any button yet. Now whenever you click on north, it will give you the counter. North clicked one times, west, east, south is zero times. Now you can click on north, see six times now you can click on west see three times east four times south five times now you can click on north seven times west five times east six times south nine times so this is the way you can implement the button and text view in android kotlin so that's it from my side. If you like this video, then please like, share and subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much. Have a nice day.